So in today's video, I'm gonna be doing a full get ready with me. So I'm pretty much gonna show you guys my hair, my makeup, and my outfit, and then whatever I do after. So I'm currently sitting on my bed right now. I'm actually uploading a video, but the video is already uploaded because I tried to film this under like 5,000 times, and I just can't not speak. I swear I can't speak today. So that's already uploaded. Also, bubbles in here, and then I was gonna use this tripod for today's video just because it's a handheld one. Um. But it keeps it right on the bottom of my camera because of this little like black button right here. It keeps it like scraping the bottom of my camera. Um, and yeah, it's supposed to be a little mini one, but it just keeps it right on the bottom of my camera. So I'm not going to use it today. But I'm just going to do like vlog style today. Um, also, I've been done and get ready with me in quite a while. But before we hop in, make sure you guys are subscribed to my YouTube channel and give this video a big thumbs up. But yeah, pretty much the first thing I'm going to do is go get breakfast because it is like 11 o'clock in the morning and I literally just woke up about an hour ago, but I've been trying to film this intro for the past like 5 minutes and I can't speak like at all. I come on messing up my words and just getting really frustrated. So hopefully this works out, but I'm pretty much going to go downstairs and get some food because I'm really hungry. So that's the first thing we're going to do. So let's go do that. Hi Bruno. Good morning, little one. This is Bruno. Hi Bruno. Hello. But I'm just gonna come over here and I'm just gonna make some breakfast, which I have my pumpkin spice bagels. This is literally like my third or second time buying these because my little brother that's up there. Cause I'm mm -mm, so pretty much just gonna make these. I'm gonna put these in the oven right here. All right, so I just made my bagels. Also, my keys on here, but I'm gonna go into the refrigerator and grab my coffee. And I'm gonna grab my bagels and go upstairs. Bye, little dog dogs. Bye, bear bear. Alright, so now I'm sitting at my desk. I'm literally just about to eat my bagels. These are the pumpkin spice ones. I just put on cream cheese. At first, I couldn't really find the cream cheese, was with the strawberry one, but I found it. And then I have my little iced coffee. This is like the only coffee that I will drink. But yeah, I'm pretty much gonna chill at my desk for a couple of minutes and eat. And then after I'm gonna get in the shower because my hair is literally so greasy. I've not washed my hair in like four days. Um, but yeah, really in the shower and then probably after the shower, I'm probably gonna do a face mask. Because I have a lot of face masks that I got from the dollar store and also up there that I haven't used. And I really wanna do a face mask because my skin is really bad right now. So it's probably what I'm going to do after the shower, so I'm going to eat, and then I'm going to the shower, and then I'll probably talk to you guys later. So I'm all done with my bagel. I literally just brought my plate down, but usually when I'm eating, I usually watch YouTube videos. I have my phone right here, and then I have my coffee. So now I'm going to go to the bathroom, because I'm going to take a shower. Also, that I hate that I have to still share a shower with my siblings because my shower is not up to working yet. I'm going to start the shower. I'm going to have to go to my bathroom. And then go to my shower club with the shampoo and conditioner. I need to be in this right here. Face wash and my body wash. And I usually grab all this stuff and do it in the bathroom. Now I'm going to go to the shower and I'm going to go my shower stuff into the bathroom and then I'll be right back. So I literally just got out of the shower so now I'm going to figure out what I'm going to wear. Also, my bathroom is literally a mess. All that is for my fall haul so don't even look at that because literally this video will be up before that. Um, so you guys were already selling all that stuff and my fall 
haul, but I'm just gonna come over here and try to figure out what I'm going to wear because I don't know what to wear. This is what I have. I have these tights. These are literally from they're like Walmart. And then a blue long sleeve because I couldn't find my black one. This one's still gonna have the tag on it because I still need to film my fall haul. But again, this video will already uploaded. And then this denim skirt that I got from I think Target like last year. And then this little universal t-shirt that I got from Cotton On. So I'm gonna put this on to see if it looks good. And then if it does, this is probably what I'm gonna be wearing today. I think this actually passes the like vibe I have my tights on. And the skirt. This is something that I wouldn't really wear, but I've seen a lot of TikTok people like dress like this and for like fall outfits, so like to do this. I would rather have a black long sleeve, but it does kind of go with like the blue and the t shirt. But this is what the outfit looks like. It actually, does not look that bad. This is from Cotton On, this is from Air Apostle, the skirt is from the Target, and the tights are from. Walmart, but this is what the outfit is looking like. Um, so now I'm going to do my makeup. This is probably a better clip of the outfit. This is what the skirt tights look like with the long sleeve. I've just put my mirror on my dresser, but also I'm going to redo my room and use them from. I'm going to put up. This is another close up of the outfit. Probably for shoes, I'm probably going to do my checkered bands, or if I really want to be full, I can wear my combat boots I'm probably gonna wear these because I feel like with the boots it would look a lot more like fallish again I would probably wear a black long sleeve but it does go with the blue um but yeah this is another close-up of the outfit I actually really like this something I wouldn't really wear but it's so cute like I would probably actually wear this because I would be kind of scared to wear it because I feel like it wouldn't really match but actually look it pretty goes pretty well together but now I'm gonna sit at my desk and do my makeup Alright, so now I'm sitting at my desk. I'm about to do my makeup. Also, you guys are balancing on a water bowl and a dip conditioning bottle. This is what the tripod is looking like because this tripod literally just broke on me because this part that usually my camera will stay on um, kind of broke. Um, it won't stay balanced, so I have to improvise and use this as a tripod. So hopefully you guys do not well, it's a little bit wobbly because the water bottle doesn't have nothing in it. But I'm going to do my makeup for my eyeshadow. I'm going to actually use the Revolution little Big Shot makeup palette. I actually show this in my Ulta haul. This is what the colors look like. I have not used it and I want to try it for this video. So this is what the eyeshadow looks like. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to do like a natural fall makeup look because I did a fall makeup look a couple of videos back which I did like an orangey look but today I'm probably going to do like a really natural eye makeup look even though this palette has a lot of like color in it I might do like a natural like brown in the crease and then maybe a little bit green like under the uh, crease line I think that'd be really cute so this is probably what I'm going to use for my eyeshadow so first I'm just going to do my face makeup I'm going to moisturize my skin first with my elf Moisturizer, you have seen me do my face makeup so many times. I'm just apply this all over my face. And for a primer, I'm going to use my e.l.f. Luminous Face Primer. I use this in my fall makeup and I absolutely love it because it leaves my skin nice and glowy. I my sister my outfit um, before I did my makeup for this clip. And I literally told her, I was like, oh my god, do you like my outfit? She's like, oh my god, it's cute. And then I was like, what, do I look like a TikTok girl? She's like, yeah. I was like, I'm not surprised, because it does look like an outfit a TikToker would wear. But I'm just applying this all over my face. And for foundation, I'm going to use my Milani foundation. I want to go for a full coverage. I'm going to use this. This is in Nude. I've used this so many times. Apply this all over my face. I'm just going to take my pea blender and blend it all out. Also, I'm using my little mirror right here so you can see. Also, I wish my camera had a backup like camera so when I'm doing this, I can see if I'm in focus because this camera goes out of focus a lot and it's really annoying. Also, 
Also, I have my phone right here because I like watching YouTube videos because I don't like sitting in silence. Like, I hate it because when I was in high school, every time I got around it, I always had Netflix on in the background or music. So, usually when I do my makeup, I usually have stuff in the background, like YouTube videos that I usually watch. I'm stuff with true crime, so a lot of my YouTube videos that I watch is like true crime or Netflix documents um, and stuff. So, it's usually what I usually do when I'm doing my makeup. And then material and then on my neck. Also, I don't really know what I'm doing today. I think me and Samuel and Mia are probably gonna go out and just go shopping because I like going shopping on Saturday because Saturday I don't work. But I really need a Christmas shop. I have some stuff in mind that I'm gonna get for everyone, but I don't know. Also, I got a for my mom and dad at Five and Below last night. Uh, I got Orloff and that Wonder Woman, so I'm really excited for this year for Christmas shopping because this year I can, but I don't know. I don't know where to start, um, so my mom's really gonna help me this year because um, I don't know what to do. Like, I know like what everyone likes my family, it's just I've never Christmas shop, so I don't really know where to start. And then for concealer, this is my elf concealer. This is like, my favorite concealer of all time. I'm just applying this. Where you need it. I'm just blending that out with my beauty blender. I'm also previewing a lot of videos because I have a lot of free time. Uh, since the days that I don't work, I usually like filming like two to three videos. So if I have to film this video, I'm probably going to film another video, which is going to be interesting, which I'm probably going to rearrange my room. I rearrange my room like every five days, like, honestly. I haven't rearranged it since I moved in this room, but I kind of want to, and I have like lights, like the TikTok lights that I want to put up, but I need that for a haul, so I'm trying to figure out like what I should do. So before I set anything, I'm actually going to cream contour and use my wet and wild cream contour. I've actually been doing this recently. I absolutely love doing this. You just put it like where you would the contour and stuff. And then just take my beauty blender and blend it all out. And this is the wet and wild uh, contour little thing. This is an oak on you. This is what it looks like when you use that as cream contour. I absolutely love it. I love doing it on my nose because I don't really like my nose. Like my side profile isn't really that balanced. Like my chin I don't really like because I don't really have a jaw. <laughs> but I like doing the cream contour on my nose because I'm really good with cream contour but I've been pretty good with it so I'm just blending it out so now I'm going to move on to bronzer I'm not going to set my foundation because I recently have not been setting my foundation um just because usually when I use powder my skin feels so dry and so flaky and I feel like I can go like this and like wipe everything off so I'm just not going to set today I'm just going to put on my bronzer this is the e.l.f. bronzer that I use. Alright, so now I'm moving on to eyeshadow. I'm going to use this palette. I don't know where to start. There's not really like neutral colors in here. Like, there's a little bit for like the orange side. Um, so I don't really know where to start with this palette. But I'm probably going to take this shade right here and put that in my crease. I'm just taking my Morphe brush and applying that to my crease. It also revolve like palettes are supposed to be like really pigmented. Um, and it's very pigmented, like it looks good. Like lightly so it's not so like dramatic, just kind of like lightly applying it. So now to deepen it a little bit so I can get a little bit more of that brown shade that I want, I'm going to take this e.l.f. eyeshadow cloth and just apply this. I'm just going to take this brown right here and add that to my crease over the shade that we just applied from the Vol palette. 
I'm just kind of mixing the two clays together. And then for the lid shade, like for a shimmer shade, I'm probably going to take this shimmer shade right here, which looks like really pretty. I'm just going to apply that to my lid. I'm going to apply that with my fingertips. And I'm just going to blend it out. Know, that looks so good. It's a great gold kind of shimmer. Apply that to my lid. And I'm just going to grab my eyeliner from Wimbledon and just do a simple wing liner. I legit have so many new like eyeliners and eyebrow stuff and like three drawers that I have over here for like new videos, first impressions, like makeup hauls. Like I literally have three drawers of like all new makeup that I'm so excited for. And a lot of it's like eyebrow stuff and eyeliners but I like eyeliners and I like eyebrow stuff because I like using different stuff I like using different brands especially for makeup doors because I don't want to be using the same stuff in all my videos now I'm just going to take a smaller brush and I'm going to put some green under my eyes I'm probably going to take uh, this screen right here in the palette. I'm just applying that with a tiny little brush and put that under my eyes. Actually, this is a really pretty shade of green. Like, that looks really good. So now moving on to mascara. I'm just going to apply my Maybelline mascara. Just apply this to my lashes. I'm gonna add some blush. I'm gonna take this little elf contour and blush palette. I'm just gonna take the blush right here and just apply that to my cheeks because I've been obsessed. Because I've been obsessed with applying blush. Like, if you asked me, like in high school, I would have not been like, no, I don't like blush. For a while, I did not like blush. And now I really like it. I'm not gonna apply it too much, like the e girl blush. I'm just gonna apply a little bit to the apples on my cheeks and also a little bit on my nose. So now moving on to highlight, I'm going to take my e.l.f. highlighting palette. I usually use this shade. I'm just taking that on my little highlight brush and just apply this as highlight. Put that primer like under the foundation. My skin looks nice and glowy because I like glowy skin. I don't like matte skin like some days I do, but usually I do like, like glowy skin because I like when my skin glows. So now I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows. I'm just going to use my elf pomade. I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows. I've been recently like, filling them in pretty good. They actually look really good now when I fill them in because before I just kind of like went like this and did it. But now I actually take my time and I actually fill them in and make sure they look good. And this is the elf small angle brush. This is actually my favorite eyebrow little brush because it's tiny. So I can actually get like a pretty good sharp line. The other ones that I have are like really long or really wide and this one's just like tiny so it's really perfect for filling in the eyebrows. Now to set everything I'm going to use the Revolve Fix and Glow setting spray. This is a doing setting spray. I'm just going to set my makeup. It smells like so good, but this is what it looks like. I'll also show this in my alcohol. And that is pretty much my makeup done. So now I'm gonna probably go to the bathroom and brush my hair and then blow dry and then I'm gonna probably style it. But this is what my makeup looks like. Also have the green under my eyes, which I feel like makes my eyes look a little bit more green since I do have hazel eyes, but this is what my makeup looks like also my skin looks very glowy because of the primer i'll link all everything that i use for my makeup today in the description bar but this is what my makeup looks like all right so now we're in my bathroom but before i do my hair i'm just going to brush my teeth real quick brush my teeth real quick Now we're gonna move on to my hair. I'm just gonna grab my little hairbrush and brush my hair. To do this 
fine even though my hair is like pretty short. But I'm gonna try because in my fall video I did a little space buns and it looked really weird. So I'm gonna already attempt it and see if I can do it. And then I'm just gonna grab some of this orange juice for cheese little oil and just put it in my hand and then apply it all over my hair. This just helps with like flyaways and stuff, so it keeps my hair nice and soft. I don't have all these flyaways. Alright, so I already have a middle part because I tried to film this clip before, but I already have a middle part with my hair. It does not really look that good, but I tried. I also have two little black hair ties. I'm just going to first take like a little section of the front so it's like my bangs out, and then I'm just going to gather. I'm just going to gather a lot of hair on this side. So like about that much hair, so it looks like that. I'm just going to kind of like twist it a little bit and then wrap it around each other so it looks like that and then I'm just going to grab a rubber band and tie it off so that's what it looks like it looks a little bit weird but that's actually a lot better than the base lines that I did so now I'm just going to do this side I'm going to grab it a little bit of hair in the front of my bills and then just gather all this hair up twist it and then wrap it around each other and grab the little rubber band and just tie it off and that's what the space buns look like don't really look um the best but that's pretty much the hair done this is what my hair looks like i have the little bangs out and then this is what the space buns look like they don't really look the best but they actually look a lot better than i did a couple of days ago but that is my hair so i am pretty much all ready to have my outfit on my hair is done my makeup is done so i hope you guys liked this video if you guys want more like a day in my life or get ready with me leave a comment down below so i probably will do more because i like filming these videos just like chatting with you guys and like doing my makeup and doing my hair and like doing different outfits for you guys but yeah, I hope you guys liked this video and I will see you guys in my next video.